since the early 2000s, the body of Christ on the African continent has witnessed great moves of revival in several forms and dimensions by the help of God. Nations worship in His presence is one of such moves. It is an annual free gospel music concert birthed in 2018 by the leading of the Spirit received by Dr. Paul and Nature and hosted by Dunamis International Gospel Center. The objective of the conference is to flood the land with the glory of the Lord. The maiden edition of the nation's worship themed The Kingdom is the Lord's held on the 28th of January 2018 at the Eagle Square with thousands of people in attendance. The worship flowed gloriously like a river as every artist ministered, touching the lives of each and everyone present. The concert featured international pastor and gospel singer Bishop Paul Merton as well as Elijah Oyelade, Owe Abutu, Prosper Ochimana, Dusin Oyekan, Mike Oguntuyibo, Daniel Ekiko, O.J. John Kings, Wisdom K, Daramola Shola, Emma Sings, Peter Sachs, and Dunamis Voice International. Then came the second edition with the theme, The Battle is the Lord's, held on the 1st of February 2019 at the Glory Dome, the 100,000-seater sanctuary of Dunamis International Gospel Center, and it was filled to capacity. It featured international ministers, Bishop Paul Merton and Micah Stampley, as well as an array of indigenous gospel ministers such as Bukola Beckers, Steve Crown, Elijah Oyelade, Dumsin Oyekan, Owe Abutu, Prosper Ochimana, Osinachi Wachuku, Emma Sings, Daramola Shola, and Dunamis Voice International. The third and most recent edition of Nations Worship in His Presence with the theme Divine Takeover held on the 31st of January 2020 and was a blast. It featured international gospel artist and minister William McDowell as well as internationally acclaimed anointed indigenous ministers such as Nathaniel Basi, Sinaj, Chioma Jesus, Dushin Oyekan, Prosper Uchimana, Usinachi Wajuku, Owe Abudu, OJ John Kings, Solo Kings, Ninja Delta Demonstration Group, Emma Sings, Daniel Ekiko, Deborah Paul and Neje, Shola Daramola, and Dunamis Voice International. In and through all these editions, drastic prophetic declarations were released concerning the destiny of our nation Nigeria and the nations of the world. Nation worship for us, Iran, the one we used to do for the first time, that is the first one for the year, that is January as it normally was. It has been a great time with God. 
we as we do experience God in this uh, in those kind of meetings. There are so many uh, ministers that comes and minister, and it used to be wonderful. Uh, the last edition uh, we were here, and uh, I think we've been attending nations worship right from the Ego Square, and it's just a revival, you know. It's just a, a place you come and you experience. Because the word of God said that the Lord inhabits the presence of His people. It's where you come and you experience the, the presence of God like never before. And you see yourself dwelling in His glory. And you will have so many ministers that are coming, true ministers of God. And every time we come here, we feel fulfilled. Uh, we feel like this is where you need to be. So I want to encourage you. Uh, thank God it's a night with you. Come and be part of this year's Nations Worship and you will testify as we are doing now. Oh, wow! It was awesome! It was wonderful! It was wonderful. It was an awesome experience. Okay. Oh. Yeah. It was great. It was, it was it was wow and it was a refreshing time in this present and I'm hoping that this next one will be such that it would it would lift our spirit especially in these current realities that we are in that everyone that would attend that would follow would go back transformed lifted in Jesus name well just like the scripture says that the part of the just is like a shining light that shines more and more brighter and brighter so we expect the, the, the program this Friday uh, to be more glorious than the, part, the, the previous one that we attended. Our expectation is high, it's, in fact, it's higher than when we came the last time. And uh, we know that it will be greater than what we experienced the last time. I'm expecting that God will touch me to serve Him this year, 2021, like never before. Jesus. Expecting a turnaround encounter in my life in all ramifications. Yeah, and I know that attending the program, my life is going to change for the better. Yeah. My expectation is that God should take me higher and God should promote me and I want to be closer to God this year. Okay, the previous one was awesome. There was the move of God, but this present one, I believe is going to be more powerful and there will be more, more of God's presence. But to praise God, automatically you bring down the presence of God. Uh, my expectations as this one comes for this Friday is to praise God and we should feel God and we should have a life, I should have a life transformation and all around turn in my life and in the life of my family. Concerning the nation worship, to me, it's like a concert. I used to watch it on TV. I used to hear people talk about it but I never knew I could be part of it. So for the past 2018 that I joined Donamis and I've attended the National Worship, it was awesome. And I pray I will never miss any of this again. And now it is here again, the 2021 edition of Nations Worship in His Presence, themed the Lord reigneth. This edition is set to bless and impact drastically the lives of all in attendance, either physically or virtually, to the glory of God. It promises to be an indelible global encounter. It will showcase artistic, musical ministrations by internationally recognized minstrels already confirmed of Nathaniel Bassi, Samsung, Freki Umo, Solomon Lange, Chris Morgan, Steve Crown, Elijah Oyelade, Owe Abutu, Prosper Uchimana, Oche John Keynes, Emma Sings, Daniel Ekiko, Mrs. Osinachi Machuku, Deborah Paul Eneje, The Lord's Trumpeter, Mr. M and Revelations, Dunamis Voice International, and a host of other talented choirs from around the capital. 
it shall be a night of songs that shall be characterized with the palpable, tangible, and feelable presence of Jehovah. The hour is upon us. The time is now. Are you excited? With Jesus' joy, let us count down to a night of encounter with the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1.